Our relationships date back. Prime Minister Peter O'Neill, who is in the autonomous region of Bougainville, in a statement said while the court's decision is respected, the government will exercise its right to appeal in relation to this decision. He says the consequences of this decision could be massive. He said landowners of major project areas must be aware of the consequences of the court actions with regards to the future operation and viability of those projects, not to mention the financial, economic and social consequences it could have on the country as a whole. Mr. O'Neill has blamed lawyers for assisting landowners in pushing for this case, adding that the lawyers were the ones who will greatly benefit through the fees they charge. He also called on the courts to appreciate the consequences of the decisions they make. As of today, Octedi Mining Limited confirmed running its normal operations, saying that the court orders were yet to be served. In the meantime, the National Court has also ordered that the cost of carrying out research into the environmental and health impacts on the communities living along the river systems be catered for through the 45 million kina held in the Trust for the People of Western Province. This research and investigation is also a directive from the court for plaintiffs to engage environmental scientists to conduct research into the extent of the environmental pollution and for health specialists to conduct research into the extent of the environmental impact on people. The judge asked them to present a preliminary report within three months. Ruth Rungola, National MTV News.